Hello, this is Eric Kirk for MamaWorld.com and welcome to our series of mini tutorials about Mocha Import Plus. This part shows the Stabilize Precomp function. The Stabilize Precomp function allows us to create a stabilized view on the tracked region inside of a precomp. Inside this stabilized view, we can do any kinds of modifications like painting, inserting elements, or doing any other kind of adjustment. All changes that we do in the Stabilize Precomp are automatically also applied to our original perspective. To create a Stabilize Precomp, first track the region that you want to manipulate and set the surface rectangle to the region you want to see in the Stabilized view. Then export the tracking data as Corner Pin without Motion Blur and load it in Mocha Import Plus. Now you can apply the Stabilize Precomp function on a duplicate of your footage layer on top of the background layer. Now you can choose the corner pin effect that you want to use. We recommend to always use the option Live Expressions instead of Keyframes, which allows you to adjust the corners of the Stabilize Precomp. If we solo the Stabilize Precomp layer, you can see that it contains only the corner pin region and follows our track. Now when we create a new comp viewer and double click the layer to open the Precomp, we can see the main comp and Stabilize Precomp side by side. If we move the corners of the CC Power Pin effect in the main comp, the content of the Stabilize Precomp changes accordingly. Once we are happy with the placement of the Stabilize Precomp, we can start doing modifications in the Precomp. As an example, we duplicate the background in the Precomp, call up the window, and draw a mask around this window in the wall. Now we can move it a bit to the side to create a second window in the wall. As you can see, the window also appears in the main composition and moves nicely with our track. We could also do any other modifications inside the precomp the same way. That's it for now. We'll see you next time, folks.